purgatory! Today we're trying weird pickle things. Uh, again? We're doing this. I've already done it! Yay! I wasn't in the first weird pickled foods. Oh, you I were, was. you were. It was horrific. I'm so scared. Sometimes these can be like somewhat okay, but the rest of the time it's just powering through. So you yeah. know what? We're gonna power through. Yeah. Just because you can technically pickle anything, it yeah. does not mean you should. You gotta change your heart, you're coming back. We're, 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 do we're doing it. We're doing it. Is this it? Pickle foods, fast and furious style. Back in for one more. Pickled onions. No, or is it pickled cabbage. It's cabbage, yeah. It's cabbage. Pickled cabbage. Red cabbage with apple. Okay. I will say, okay, the smell uh, is the smell's not pleasant, but it's the smell's only unpleasant because it's it, once you if you suspend your disbelief. <laughs> I've had pickled cabbage before. Oh, I'll pickle your cabbage now in a second if you don't want to shut yeah. that fuck up, Sean. Um, Till it's red. No. Oh. <sighs> This is definitely not supposed to be eaten like a bowl of cereal mm. by itself, but you yeah. know what? We're here to do a job. I know. We're here to try something we're and we're gonna try it. Okay. For you. Yeah. For you. Definitely not bad, not too pickly. It actually is not as bad as it smells. I expected it to be worse from what I remember. <laughs> Very bad. Oh no, it's, oh, no, 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 oh, no, 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 it's, it's so fucking oh, bad. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna be awful. There's more taste of old carpet off it than anything. Um, oh, it's red carpet, red not cabbage. Car oh, carpet. of course. What the hell is red cabbage? Yeah, it's red carpet. Yeah. I get it. Are you hopeful for what's to come? No. You're, you're easing us in. You're like, oh, everything's okay. This is pickled cabbage. This is gonna be a great shoot. Before you know it, we're gonna have pickled camel lips or something. This is really bizarre because like, what I was, I was just about to say, People really do have very different tastes in things. And it's like, that's the whole point <laughs> of the channel. That's the whole point of the channel. Like, do you know what it shows us? It really does take all sorts oh. to make the Tri Channel world. Oh, well, actually, that can be all right. Warm about the sugar rind. <laughs> sweet, pickled sweet pickled watermelon rind. Old sack. Yeah. Like it looks softer than I would expect for, oh, okay, so it is a bit harder. And it's changed color entirely. Our specialty since 1947, a perfect accompaniment for beef, pork, fish, and poultry dishes adds zest to tuna salad, sauces, and dressing, or can be cubed and wrapped in bacon for sumptuous whores divorce. So delicious, the first cookbook <laughs> published in the US contained a recipe for sweet pickled watermelon rind. Yay! Yeah, interesting that they advise to pair it with meats. Yeah, I'm, I'm very, very, very confused. Mm. Who thought, Jesus, you know what? We're not gonna waste any of the watermelon. Stick that in some That's vinegar. good though, Laura. The world's on fire for God's sake. <laughs> Do you ever just like to, you know, relax and unwind? Yeah. I like to wake up and, you know, eat all my water around in the morning, you know. Rise and rind is what I say. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dermot, it's okay. It's just rind over matter. Hey! <laughs> Woo! Can we go in? Yeah, let's go for it. I'm just gonna cube it up there. Uh, <laughs> that's not all rind with him. Oh, that is good. It's not nice. <laughs> it's not not nice. Like it's it's. I just want you to lie to me for like five seconds. I'm sorry. It tastes like marmalade. It does taste like marmalade. It reminds me of marmalade, and I don't like marmalade. I couldn't be further from hungry right now. So you know when you've had a lot to eat and there's still food on your plate, you're like, I couldn't eat another bite. You know that feeling? Mm -hmm. Yeah, imagine that and then imagine you fuckers coming along and putting putting five different pickled things in front of me. How that would take oh, you son of a Step up on the red cabbage? Oh Absolutely. yeah. Massive step up on the mm. red cabbage. This is like a dessert pickle. Yeah. <laughs> is that a possible thing, like dessert pickles? Oh, that's not for me at all. No, but look, end of the world, yeah, Grant, I'll, I'll chew on some fermented watermelon rice. Yeah, yeah. Where do you think we go from here? Yeah. Oh, it can only get better, can't it? Ring bologna. It's a bologna is how they pronounce that, isn't it? Bolo like it's it looks like bologna, but it's it's pronounced bologna. Oh, like from an arse. <laughs> yeah. 
Like you're rang like fuck. We here at Theatrix Meats and Country Store would love you to try our hot pickled ring bologna. Mm. Bologna is like pepperoni, except more like your um, sandwich version of a pepperoni. Okay. Yeah. I can like get down your, with that. Your, like your, what's his name? The happy guy that lives in the ham? What's his name? Billy Roll. Billy Roll. I can't. Billy Roll. First name Billy, last the name Roll. The happy guy that lives in the ham. <laughs> I swear to God, any other day I'd be, I'd be quite, I'd be excited about this. I'd be like, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm eat, I haven't eaten. You know, yeah. but, um, but uh, this is, uh, although let's, let's be honest, I've probably eaten all the different meats that are in this separately. Because this is, well, this is what, this is like fucking hog anus and everything like that, isn't it? Oh yeah. Oh, so yeah. it is ring bologna. So it is ring bologna. I like salami, I like pepperoni, mm. I like pepperami, I like mm. all Spiced of those meats. Amis, spiced meats. Mm. And this it looks good. Smells good. Yeah. Oh, shite. Oh, you've already gone. I'm oh. sorry. No, oh, that bad. That's meat. Yeah. Hmm? Just a regular old sausage. Oh, fucking hell. I really, really don't like it. <laughs> what the hell is that? Weird. I just thought I saw um I saw George. No. Oh. The pickledyness is quite overpowering to the meatiness. It's still good though. Yeah, it's good. Like it's edible. It's really good. Flavor-wise, it? It's pickled meat. <laughs> it's literally <laughs> vinegar, a bit of sugar, and meat. Yeah. There's no rule on the channel that says when you're trying a food that you have to swallow it, right? No, once you taste it, you can talk about Th it. Then that's what, then I've done that. That was, that was pretty good. You have tried it and know what it tastes like. I know so what it tastes like. That's fine. You don't need to. Know I don't know what it feels you, like inside my belly. Yeah, you don't need to know don't how to. it digests. That's not what. System. That's not what tasting is. Yeah. So compared to other meaty pickled things we've had in other videos, this probably tastes kind of the same, mm -hmm. but it's the least like offensive. Big, yes. I know I'm being an absolute gobshite with this whole situation. I understand. No. But hey, don't do that. Don't apologize. <laughs> Okay, in this business, <laughs> you gotta keep your fucking head on. Or are you gonna stick with yourself? I'm not sorry. And no one else is gonna bet for you. You gotta <laughs> bet for yourself, okay, kid? Is it the worst bologna I've ever had? Technically, yes, this is the only one I've ever had. But is it the best I've ever had? Probably not, no. Well, probably... no, but technically, yes, because no, it's the only one you've ever had. Well, so there you go. Yeah. It's Schrodinger's bologna. Ah. Mm. Schrodinger's ring, or. Oh good, pickled ringworm. <laughs> we had ring bologna, now we have ringworm. Oh god. It is. Pork rinds? Pork rinds is actually significantly better than what I was expecting. This to me just looks like strips of gack. Yeah. Where where did you get these in Dublin? Because I, I just, I don't want to go into an establishment that sells it even. <laughs> Although this does remind me of uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. In the movie, the 1990 movie, Raph and Leo are fighting. Mikey and, and, and Donnie are, they want to leave and they're they're eating snacks and stuff and they go, pork rind, pork rind. I love that you, ha you have her face and then you've got pork skins, water, vinegar, salt, jalapeno, chili slices, citric acid and oregano. As in I her saying that, you know, helps in any yeah. way. Oh, the smell isn't. Too bad. It smells like glue. <laughs> Does that smell like me? <laughs> Pork rind? Pork, Pork rind. rind. Oh. There you go. <laughs> Can I do it? Oh. <clears throat> that, that is wrong on so many levels. Ew. Oh my God. It tastes like glue. <clears throat> Can you? Can you stop doing it while I stop? Sorry, yeah, go for it. Mm -hmm. Can you let me just get the food? Sorry, yeah, sorry, go ahead, go ahead. The first time I ever had absinthe, I put the shot into my mouth and I compulsively vomited everywhere. It was like, it's the same sort of thing, like your body just rejects it. It kind of tastes like when you're like licking an envelope. Yeah, see, glue. Yeah. That's what I'm saying, I keep saying glue. Your teeth also just. Just glide through the, yep. it was like, truly was like uh, piggy ice cream in your mouth. Oh, there's nothing like a bit of gloopy meat, is there? Mm, yeah. Nice gloopy, gloopy rind. Like this should not yeah. be eaten. It definitely also, it says ready to eat. Ready to eat my whole, mm. um, don't eat my whole. I could have swallowed that, I just didn't want, because oh, my I body, my body immediately that. went, this is not, this is not food, it's chemicals and you've, you, mistakenly swallowed this. Again, I didn't swallow it, but I did taste it. And so I've tried it. So 
Well, and I've heard Dermot say that every Tuesday night. So. Oh, what in the fuck is that? Jesus Christ. Oh, holy sweet mother of divine Jesus. What is that? That's liver, isn't it? That's, it's, it's not liver. It's not liver, I don't think. Oh, what is that? It's the jar of brown. <laughs> jar of brown. If you turn this around, it just says a jar of brown. Pickled jar of brown. <sighs> Heart. God. So, do you like beef? I love beef, yeah. Do you like hearts? No. I've I haven't loved hearts when I've tasted them, but they've been smaller hearts. Oh, uh, mine mine looks less like a yeah like a marble. Yours kind of look, mine looks you, fucking. Mine you, looks like it's, you, it looks like a bowling ball. I had a bowling ball with that color with my oh. name etched on it. Do you ever have a heart, Paddy? I've never had heart. Well, I don't remember having heart. Maybe I've suppressed a memory. Uh, You've never had heart. <laughs> I don't have. I don't life, have a heart, boy. Sean. You've never had heart. Ah, oh, stop. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's fucking. It's a play. Ah, oh, it's. Well, how about we? How about we go back in time, right? And we just tell you it's just some overdone steak because that's kind of what it looks like. That is a thick heart, by the way. Am I wrong? Wow, oh, strong heart. Stout hearted. Yeah. Joe, Joe cows. Yeah. They have four of them, don't they? Oh, or they have four bellies. Four bellies. They're not the time lord cows. They're not. Yeah, that's it. That's the. They always get cows and time lords mixed up. That's Dr. Moo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this video is all been worth it. It's all worth it. This kind of reminds me of um, the gizzards where they looked awful, but like the taste was actually just meh. fine. Well, we're at the end. <laughs> it's been a wild ride. Just of the video. Not a <laughs> Not of our <laughs> lives or anything. It's gra it's gonna be okay. No. Down the hatch. Here we go. Yeah. No. Oh, oh, oh. Reminds me a little bit of tuna fish. A little bit of tuna, yeah. You know what I mean? No. I mean, I wasn't optimistic. It tastes exactly how I expected it to taste. Ah. This was um. Oh. Sorry. Bad. Bad. Sorry. A bit of the juice just really hit the spot back there. Again, yeah. again, the pickly flavor is a bit too much for me, but like as meats go, it's not bad. It's not the worst. Oh, sweet Jesus Christ. That was that. No, stop. Stop the lights. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm not doing anything. <laughs> Look, it's the pickling that makes it bad. Let's be uh, honest. Yes, it's if, you're a, if you're a fry this up, season it a bit. Could be great. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's meat, but it's it's a pick and fucking beef heart for fuck's sake. In a jar. In a jar. If you got a beef heart normally and cooked it like you would a steak, I think it could actually be quite nice. It could. Um, I feel so. I feel. I don't. I, I don't I'm having survivor's guilt. I don't know why. Like I feel okay. <laughs> I'm like, oh, thank God I got to do that. It's not like I took any of it off your hands or no, anything like, like that. I just. But I would have, if I could have. I would have done all that for you. Thank you. Yeah. But yeah, I just don't see it being like, boy, there's nothing more merry than getting yourself a nice cow, ripping its heart out, saying Kali Moo, and then <laughs> sticking it into a jar. You, you know? did that just for me. I know you did that just for me. That wasn't for anyone else. Mm -hmm. It was just for me. Uh, I got a big heart inside me. I got a heart full. Of mm. cow. Mm. Yeah. Same. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Where did that come from? Oh, jeez. <laughs> this is how we turn into wear cows. <laughs> so, guys, a selection of even more weird pickled foods. What do you think overall? How, how did I just say that? I found it was only slightly traumatizing. As weird pickles things go, mm -hmm. not the worst we've ever done. I think exactly what I thought at the start, which is that you can pickle anything. But you shouldn't necessarily. In the last pickled one I did, I, I literally, I like I chomped on a pig's snout. You did. You know what I mean? You did. And if I had, if I, if I hadn't eaten today, I would have grabbed that fucking beef heart and just hung into it. Mm, I wouldn't have liked it, but I still would have done it. Uh, so I feel bad. So to my apologies to the viewers. And look forward to him chomping on a pig's nipple in Pickled Foods 5. Ha! <laughs> oh no, yeah, yeah. No, tell the people to like and subscribe. You, you know, like and subscribe, new videos, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Links down below to Merchant Patreon. If you can kind of say that, that'd be good. Comment, leave a nice comment. See you in the next video, that kind of stuff. You wanna say anything like that? No, you got it. Okay. <laughs>